Why is Komorowski being released? Well, at Komorowski's first bond hearing last August, the judge warned state prosecutors if they didn't bring Komorowski to trial by March, she would be released on bond until a trial date could be set. No trial date has been scheduled, and that means for now, Komorowski is free. On April 29th last year, Komorowski was charged with three counts of felony DUI, resulting in great bodily injury and death, plus one count of reckless homicide. According to police, Komorowski plowed her car into the back of a low-speed vehicle in Folly Beach, carrying a newlywed couple just hours after they said, I do. New bride Samantha Miller was killed, and her groom Eric Hutchinson was severely injured. Another person riding with them was also injured. Police say Komorowski was driving 65 miles per hour in a 25 miles per hour zone, and her blood alcohol level was three times over the legal limit. According to court documents, Komorowski will now be required to wear an ankle monitor and will be under house arrest. She'll only be permitted to leave her house for medical emergencies or under court order. Komorowski must also stay in Charleston County and surrender her passport. And lastly, the judge has ordered that she cannot drive. Reporting, I'm Ann Emerson, News 4.